guys. No, thanks. We don't want to do that. Thank you. Salofalava and Grey just clocked off work. I'm um, still a bit dark. Uh, I thought I'd just swing past through uh, where I'll be gigging tonight, uh, which is Wyndham Werribee Culture Centre. As you can see, this yellow shelter type of thing there. This is one of the locations I usually do solo live music for the council. So uh, if you want any updates, make sure you follow us on Miller Tunes. And as you can see, the footage down below, they're normally held in events called Lit or Light. Without going on me, I don't know. So it's a free event for the community. So I'm kind of expecting this place to be packed out tonight uh, with families enjoying good food and, of course, enjoying the lighting show. For more information, WyndhamCity.com. few moments later. That's the football stadium. She's a warm one today, so about twenty seven degrees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, I got 
I'll just go stop there, that's all. Yeah. I'll take it down the road today. Yeah. yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah, right. Thank you, Seth. Appreciate that. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure, just in case. getting shown on where about I'm standing so let's do it hey guys so a bit nervous um, what time is it now it's 2.27 so about three minutes until sun check I'm gonna be going straight there like around the middle and um, just do a mic check and um, yeah I'm just don't wanna f up just don't wanna stuff up the lyrics eh? but um, yeah we'll see how we go eh? So at this point, I usually go through this weird phase just before I jump on stage or any sort of platform that I perform at. Till this very day as a performer, still trying to fight through these hella nerves that I go through. Even though this is only sound check, bro, your boy still goes through these phases. But usually I do a quick prayer that normally gets me going. Also gives me the confidence that I need to get through my set. Oh, okay. I can turn it the up radio now. is a bit loud, eh? The <laughs> I can hear the music. Is that meant to come through? Or? No, I'll just turn it up. Okay, yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Yep. Nice, yep, <laughs> nice. Thank you. <laughs> Few minutes later. Pretty cool setup, huh? It begins for us, it truly comes to the West for the very first time. My name's Mark Brown and I am an Elder and Senior Cultural Heritage Officer at the Bunurong Land Council. I'm a Gundijamara man on my mother's side and I'm a Bunurong man on my father's side. So today I'm here to welcome you to my father's country, beautiful Bunurong country. But before we do that, we take a moment. We also pay acknowledgments and respects to all traditional owners, Aboriginal and Torres Strait, who work, rest, live or play on Bunurong country. And we thank you all for being here with us. But today on this sacred land, we all gather in the spirit of respect, unity and reconciliation.
Oke. Okay. That's a wrap, guys. Finished. Literally just a five minute, five minute set. Oh no, not even. It wasn't. It was just like a 30 second set, and then I'm done. You like my scarf? Bro, I don't even know what this. I don't even know what this team is, but let's go. Sorry, I thought that was good. Did you put a bird Ah! I was just doing my lap, mom! So, what, you live in the pool house now? Yeah. Hey. Wow. Yeah. This is cute. Oh, what? It looks so scary. No, it's good like that. You almost killed me, Jumbo! Alright. Is this going to be their little entrance? <laughs> You like it, Mila? Yeah, we just gotta do this other castle. Castle. Do the what's it called? The lum. Show you, baby, like this. Today, please. <laughs> what a fail. At least I got halfway under. <laughs> this is a very big test for my knees. charge. <laughs> 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 Charge the song. Mila is not ready yet. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Alright guys, we're upstairs now. Um, so it's a cinema room slash play area for the kids. Mind whatever we have up there. That's as you can see, Mila's got a lot of stuff. So um, got to figure out where we're gonna store some stuff. And we got some couches to bring from up from downstairs to bring upstairs. Yeah, we got a pretty big house for for a small family. Um, might as well use the, utilize the space. Let's get done before I go to work. Let's go. So this is the progress so far. I, um, try to make it spacious around here so the kids can, um, you know. All I need to figure out where these two are gonna go. What I've come across as well is this. Uh, I need to figure out a way how we can block this. It's weird how they did, the blind doesn't cover the whole window. So that's all window. So I'll figure out a way to uh, block that. <clears throat> But yeah, so far so good. <sighs> Hopefully Emila likes this.
trust again. Isn't that what we want to do? We're the worst girl. Bye, Bronx. Bronx, say bye bye. Say thank you. <laughs> so Mila's saying goodbye. Off the no, just a little bit. I don't want it on the light. I'm just sitting at the back of it. What if he falls down? Oh, okay, I'll sit over there. Say bye, Bronx. Bye. Bye. Okay.